Hi, I'm JD, and today we're going to be using the TI-84 Plus calculator, and we're going to be going over operations with mixed numbers. I'm going to show you um, multiplication, division, and then also addition, and then with a negative. All right, so the first thing that you want to do with your TI-84 Plus calculator is change the mode, and you want to change it from classic to math print. So let's get to the next screen. So to select, you highlight it and push enter. Now, if I look at these two, notice that um, that is numerator denominator. So that could be an improper fraction, but if you want it as a mixed number, you would select this. This is um, unit and then numerator denominator. So let's select that. Now this is on auto, so you can either have it fixed to decimal or fraction. If it's in classic, you're always going to get a decimal. All right, so I'm going to keep it on auto. So second quit. So all those settings should be in place now. So now um, what you can do is type, just type that in. So you would find that under the mixed number key, I guess you could say, under math. So select math and then go to number. Now it's all the way at the bottom, so I'm going to push up and that takes me all the way down here. And I want that mixed number, so units, and then n numerator denominator. So select that. Now just use the arrow keys to navigate. So I just push one, push over, down, eight, so times. Um, I'm going to push four, um, math. Again, going back to that. See, now it just filled that in for the unit, so now I can just type in the rest. So four thefts, there we go. So for number one, that's five and two thefts. All right, we could do the same thing with division. Two first, math, number, like that to sevenths divided by one. See, I'm clicking over and then up and then selecting that eleven twenty first. See how it identified that and put it automatically in parentheses. That's nice. So one and a half. Let's do the last one. Uh, whenever you're doing a negative first, you want to use the negative key. So that's negative eight. Uh, back to math. Over. Over. And then I did up. 13 fifteenths plus 4 imagine trying to do this by hand um, and then you have uh, 4 and 3 tenths it's not that bad but calculator does make it really easy That's negative 4 and 17 thirtieths. And that's it. If you have any questions, uh, please email me, jdmathguy at gmail.com. Also, with this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you, and I hope you have a wonderful day.